With the appointment of Datuk Dr. Siti Hamisah Tapse as Secretary General, the Energy, Science, Technology, Environment and Climate Change Ministry is now led by three accomplished engineers, all women. Minister Yobi Yin is a chemical engineer, her deputy Isna Raisa Munirah Majlis, an electrical engineer, and Siti Hamisah, a civil engineer. Hamisa, who clocked in on Friday, was appointed to replace Datuk Sri Dr. Azhar Yahaya, who retired on November 6. Yeo said Hamisa was chosen as the highest ranking civil servant in her ministry due to her experience in academia, the education ministry, as well as her educational background. Dr. Hamisa is the, uh, the most suitable candidate, most qualified. Uh, and then, coincidentally, that she's a woman. I, I did not make a decision because she's a woman. I make a decision because I think that she has the motivation, she has the qualification, and she has the uh, characters uh, to be able to help uh, to lead this uh, ministry. You also said after the Women, Family and Community Development Ministry, the Energy, Science, Technology, Environment and Climate Change Ministry was the only other ministry led by women. The Women, Family and Community Development Ministry is led by Deputy Prime Minister Datuk Sri Dr. Wan Aziza Wan Ismail, Deputy Minister Hannah Yeo and Secretary General Datuk Junidah Kamarudin. MESA is the second ministry after Women Ministry with uh, Minister, that is uh, Minister, Deputy Minister, and Cassio as a as a woman. So so, but then we our our role is really to move STEM and move uh, the technical of it. So so, I do think that the the qualifications comes with the specialization of of the ministry. It has nothing to do with what we deliver. We need to work very very hard and very committed and uh, objective minded to drive our agenda in in the next year. We hope that this uh, combination will also uh, tell our young generation of girls, you know, do not shun away from being in STEM, taking STEM and all that. And uh, uh, hope that it can inspire more people who are interested in engineering and science to continue to pursue that. Do not, do not shun away from it just because we are, we are ladies and we are girls. Huh?